Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're going to try to make this stick out even more. We're gonna work on the telephone poles. Um, so what I'm gonna do is come in here and really emphasize this first one. This first one is gonna be the closest to us. It's gonna have the most detail and it's gonna be the thickest because it's the closest to us. As it goes back into space, it's gonna get thinner, lighter, and less detailed. And you can just use your hand. I mean, you know, try try to try to draw as straight a line as you can. You know, like this. That isn't. That certainly isn't perfect. And if you want to get even more perfect, use your ruler. But uh, you know, and you can come back in here and erase away too. You know, like this is way too thick, obviously. There. That's a little. That's a little better. Okay. So. Oop. Earthquake. Sorry. <laughs> All right. So, um, and again, we'll, we'll, we'll take a look at this again. You have like your two bars there, and there's lots of different telephone poles. I just decided to do the ones like this, and then you have the little things going back as well. So you just take your pencil and draw a straight line across. And then this one here, right below it. There's a little bit of space in between. And this one, not quite as far out as this one. See, this one's here, this one's here. Okay. Now the second one, I'm going to do the same thing. Not as thick, though, because it's further back in space, remember. But we're still going to do it dark, so it pops out. See that? Now you can see... And what I told you guys about changing value, uh, this value here, let me zoom in too so you can see what I'm talking about. I'll even put it up. You see how that pops out now? You can't see it because of the light how, you know, normally. So this is darker than this value so it does pop out and creates that, okay, this is the dirt, this is the telephone pole. Okay. Zoom back out. All right. Third one, two. I'm just gonna make sure I got all my telephone poles. I got all my poles in a row. Same thing here. But as you go back, it's gonna get thinner and lighter. It's not gonna get. As, it's not gonna be as dark. There we go. Now once again, we're gonna do a straight line across, and then another straight line across, but not as long as the top one. And you're gonna do the same thing. And you see how they get smaller? And smaller as you go back into space. Kind of like that. Then, you just kind of, that is the wire. Let's see how that works. And then the next one, and then the next one. And then back again. Kind of same rules apply. It's going to get it's going to get smaller as you go back into space, and also lighter until it kind of just disappears like that. So you guys can see now. That's what that looks like. pretty simple actually um, so I mean that we're getting we're getting close now we have our really our foreground done and so next I'm going to show you how to approach the sky the sky is going to be 
probably the most difficult part and we'll just do it as accurately as we can. So I'll show you that technique in just a little bit.